Any thoughts on how the uh, Trump administration is doing? In terms of the economic? Well, put your... It's terrific. Okay. The taxes are down, regulations withdrawn, the economy is expanding. Okay. So that's a plus. I think the immigration policy is all wrong. We are not full. Right. And we have benefited over the decades from having people come here and to say that we're full when there's 7.3 million unfilled jobs in the United States. And if you go to any agricultural area, they're saying, hey, I need people to pick the strawberries. We're not full. Right, so right. I think that's a big problem. Yeah. What, what, what about Trump's position on uh, China and tariffs? Do you, how, how, do you, how do you think he's doing with tariff negotiations? Well, I think China has a lot of policies that we need to try to get changed. But I'm, he says he's a tariff guy. That's saying I'm a tax guy. A tariff uh, is a tax. Right. What about consumers? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I think that uh, it's important. And he has got the Chinese attention, that's for sure. But I think there are better ways of going about it. Yeah. Okay, now let's put your Secretary of uh, State hat on. How, how do you think he's doing as far as foreign policy? Well, I think the genius of our post-World War II foreign policy was that we reached out and we formed coalitions of various kinds with people, NATO, G20, G7, and so on, to solve problems. And I think it's important to keep doing that. Mm -hmm. And not to alienate or destroy these right. organizations. Do, do you do you think he's taking the right position on uh, Venezuela now and urging uh, the the opposition there, or should he be? I think it's important to urge the opposition, but I also feel that you got to pay attention to boot camp. When I was in Marine Corps boot camp at the start of World War II, I remember the day the sergeant handed me my rifle. Uh -huh. Just take good care of this rifle. This is your best friend. And remember one thing. Never point this rifle at anybody unless you're willing to pull the trigger. No empty threats. Wow. That's boot camp wisdom. Yeah. Do, do you we think... We have to be careful that we don't act as though we're going to do something and then we don't do something. Right. Do you think it could be justified for the United States to use military in Venezuela? If it's done right. Okay. Now, what about Iran? What, what do you think of the tightening of the sanctions? Good idea. Yeah. And and what about uh, North Korea? How do you how do you think the president's handling that? Well, it's a very tricky business because Korea has made a uh, a career out of saying, "You do something, and I'll make a promise," which they don't deliver on. Right. Right. So somehow you have to pin them down, and they haven't pinned them down. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. I really appreciate that.